Welcome back, survivors. <clears throat> In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the location of every single exile foothold, as well as the rewards you'll be able to find there. And trust me, those footholds have a lot of useful rewards. But before we get started, if you enjoy this video, please hit that subscribe button. We're so close to a thousand subscribers, we're only 98 away. But anyways, let's get into it. First up, we got Hotel Eclair. The Hotel Eclair foothold is gonna be right here on the map, on the second floor in the Jazz Club room. Now, Hotel Eclair is a pretty special foothold because this is the only place you can find this recurve bow. The recurve bow is one of a kind. It has its own sight on it. Pretty cool. They even have a practicing thing right here. But the other things you can find here, you can find regular arrows, noise arrows, explosive arrows. And take a look at this. You can find a box of organics and industrial boxes. These are really good because as you can see, they contain stimulants, which are pretty hard to find. And this one contains three steel pipes, which are also pretty hard to find. And I still can't get over the fact of how cool this bow is. Next up, the Memorial Lane foothold will be right here on the map on Bordock Street. This camp is also a good one because every single day you can find six... Don't get any ideas. You can find six suppressors which are very, very good. These are extremely useful at night and they help you be stealthy. Nothing better to do? Shut up! I'll kill you, bro. Say it one more time, I swear I'll kill you, bro. With a sword, each and every one of you. That's the tourist. It doesn't look so tough. Who said that? Who said that? Yup, yup, yup. Guess what you're saying yourself. You gotta show your face! Yes, it is. No, he's gonna kill me. Oh. You can find six laser sights and a custom 9mm pistol. And that's it for the Memorial Lane foothold camp. For the ward foothold, you're going to want to come right here on the map to the Nile Shipping Building. And then down that hallway where those candles are right here. The foothold is going to be right in here. And from this foothold camp, you're going to get these herbal poultice bandages. These things are like one of the best things in the game because if you use one, it restores your entire stamina bar and health bar at the same time. And it does it faster than any bandage in the game. There will also be six pain pills and three herbal medicines. So yeah, this is a pretty good exile foothold. You're gonna want to come back here every once in a while. That's the tourist. Doesn't look so tough. Nothing better to do. Okay. For the bastion foothold, it's gonna be in the bottom left of the map, right here. At this foothold, you're gonna find National Guard knives. It's the only one that has creatine, which reduces stamina costs with melee weapons. And you can find about five of these here every single day. You can't pick up those weapons. Those are just for show. Nothing better to do? Don't hang around too long. Oh my God, he's talking. Just don't. The Rampart Foothold is gonna be on the second floor of the gym, and it'll be right here on the map. At this foothold, you can find plenty of grenade launcher shells, which you can't find anywhere else. So that makes this foothold already really good. You'll also be able to find about seven grenades here every day. You might have to kill some reclaimed on your way here. If you spawn at this skiff. Nothing better to do? All right, the foothold for Via Corolla is gonna be in the yard of Greenhouse right here on the map. What you're gonna find at this camp it's eight smelling salts every Top single day and a singular worn SMG. <sighs> oh. Don't get any ideas. <laughs> the shallows foothold is going to be right here on the map and it'll be in a yard north of Blue House. You can crawl through this little hole in the fence to get to it, and there might be some tower guards near. At this foothold, you can find plenty of flare arrows, as well as just flares, and a couple of lighters and candles, which are a good source of shafts. That's the turret. 
Next up, we got the Bourbon Street Foothold. So since Sable died in this playthrough, I didn't get access to the Bourbon Street Foothold, but the camp will be located upstairs in the bird lounge and inside of it, you'll be able to find energy drinks and medium ammo boxes. For the Bywater Exile Order, it's gonna be right here on the map at the Tom's Lumber Building. To this foothold's more for just supplies, but here you're gonna find a ton of wood. You're gonna find about 72 wood scraps a day at this foothold. You can also find a whole bunch of crowbars. Uh, this weapon kinda sucks, so I guess you could just recycle it. And then there'll be a couple of survival box here too. And if you haven't already, you can head upstairs and behind this box, there'll be a cool little toy train waiting for you. And there you go. Those are all the footholds. Thanks for making it to the end of the video. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one, survivors.